Good morning everyone. Welcome. I was say welcome back to another weekly vlog. I haven't weekly vlogged in a little while. Um, so we are back with the weekly vlogs. It is currently Tuesday, 10 to 8, and I'm sat here with my cup of coffee. I'm about to log into work. Um, but I just thought that I would start off the vlog now. Obviously I said it was Tuesday and not Monday. Basically, long story short, went out yesterday to go watch Aiden's football game because it was bank holiday Monday in the car about half an hour away from home and I was like, I forgot my camera. <laughs> Which is obviously, you know, not a great start to the weekly vlogs, but I'm sure I shall get used to it and I will not get the camera because I kind of want to refuse to vlog on my phone because I don't like phone footage. It just doesn't sit well with me. So um, yeah, it's an exciting week this week. It's gonna be a bit of like a homely vlog actually today. I have a new bed come in. I think I've mentioned a few times that I'm currently like transforming <laughs> my room. So I guess on the vlogs, you guys are gonna get a sneak peek. And yeah, I'm just really excited to get back to vlogging because I feel like unless you vlog, you don't really get to know the YouTuber that you're watching. I used to vlog all the time, so, you know, here we are. I was gonna say something else. Oh, it's Aiden's birthday this week, which is super exciting. He's gonna be 23, um, but that's not until Friday. And then we're out on Friday night, we're out on Sunday. And then next week, we're going away as well. So next week's vlog will be really exciting. Also, quick question before I leave. Um, weekly vlogs, about 45 minutes, is that all right with you guys? Let me know what you prefer. Would you prefer a short one where I literally like check in? or a really in-depth one, like 45 minutes. Let a girl know. Guys, something very exciting has just turned up. Literally 8.30, already here. So it's just in these free parcels. So Aiden, obviously it's downstairs. So when Aiden gets home, he's been lifting locks all day and he's gonna have to help me get this upstairs. Guys, we've had an outfit change. I'm honestly, like so freaking cold i don't even know what's happened it's the 31st of august and i'm about to get out my heater which i put away at the start of summer because it was too hot obviously for my heater to be out so yeah you guys are wondering that little heater i think it was like 40 to 50 pound from amazon and it's really good like it will heat up this whole room in, in like 10 minutes or so but um yeah i literally have now gotten changed i am like the face of fashion i'm sure of it um i do actually have a h&m parcel coming i'm so ready for winter and autumn and autumn fashion um see so yeah, i've got a, i've got a h&m parcel coming hopefully this week so i'll give you guys a mini little haul um and yeah i'm just gonna go edit a video i spent a hundred pounds on mcdonald's to see if I could win anything on the Monopoly, which would be up already by the time you guys are watching this. So um, if you haven't seen that and you want to go see that, it's on my channel now. Oh, that was a great idea. I left my little heater on for like 10 minutes whilst I made my lunch. And now my room is all nice and toasty. But honestly guys, please excuse the um, the noise. These guys, are they're from Yo Sushi. Pretty sure we just get them from Tesco though. Write them in the oven for eight minutes. They are incredible. I have sweet cheese sauce with them though instead of the one they give you because I don't really like the one they give you. But um, yeah, literally a whole pack of these. Perfect for my lunch. Hello everyone, it's been a while since I last vlogged. Aiden is now here. here. Which means this bed is going and the new one is being put up so basically i think we get this bed down and then bring up the other one and put it up so say goodbye to this bed forever bye 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 hey, this is gonna be so fun <laughs> we'll keep that in Oh, yeah, I think so, Oh! Ow, my arm! Oh! You got it? Yeah. Oh, it's lit! I really like it. Yeah? It's perfect. You happy with it? Yeah, it's like the perfect colour. Right. What do you think? Yeah. Good colour. Like, actually perfect. Exactly what I wanted. That's all that matters, isn't it?
Oh guys, this is bent. It doesn't work for our ottoman. Right guys, this is the, the finished bed. It honestly looks so much nicer than the other bed. No offense, Aiden, sorry. <laughs> but the only thing I'll say, okay, it was an absolute pain to put together. It's probably take us about like three hours. Yeah. I mean, albeit we did actually put it together wrong, but I'm done, honestly. It's like 10 o'clock nearly. I still need to work. So um, oh, I'm gonna sign off for the night and talk to you guys in the morning. We also need to sort this out. I'm hoping that Aiden will do it whilst I'm working. Not just break, just just break it down. I've got to work. Good morning, guys. So it is now the next day. How cute does my bed look? I'm honestly obsessed with it. Like it's so my vibe. Um, and it's exactly what I was looking for. So very very. Very happy. Now obviously the next day, yes I am in the same clothes because you know what, didn't really do, well I was, you know, busy doing nothing yesterday and I feel like I'm busy doing nothing again today, like I'm not going out anywhere. I was meant to be going down to Lakeside but Lakeside is such a trek for me. But I need to go pick up my laptop from Apple and <laughs> do you know what the most annoying thing is, is I dropped it off on Sunday and by the time I got home on Sunday I got an email saying oh you can come pick it up. I was like are you joking? Like I literally live an hour away from Lakeside. So it's just such, I could, oh, I just can't be bothered. <laughs> However, today, the things on my checklist, well, I've already ticked off two of getting a mirror and lamps. I do want to film some kind of reel. I might do like a hair care reel because my hair needs a wash. It's a little bit greasy. Guys, <laughs> look what's turned up. I can't really show you. My H&M parcel. Very excited about this. I thought we could do a quick little unboxing oh okay so first i picked it up it's not really gonna go on me very well because i've got a clip in is this little tanned neutral sandy color cap and it says new york and then i picked up this chocolate colored ribbed long sleeve top to go with i'm so excited for these this is what i saw on tiktok which is what made me go over I got a little cropped gilet. So they have it in black, white, and brown. The white one was out of stock, but it's like a cream color. Um, so I just got the, the brown one and the black one. I am on the hunt for the white one. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. So I thought this, well, actually I think I saw the model in it. I did not, <laughs> I'm not taking credit for that. But like this, cute right so i picked that up so this is just the black they're really nice thick material the black one i think i've got everything in a small as well i don't know why i'm trying this one on as well i got the crop top in like the creamy white color just because i thought it like it's quite a staple isn't it let's be honest so last year as well i never got into like the sweater vest thing i just i don't know i just didn't so i picked up a shirt dress i know people normally just wear like oversized shirts but i picked up a shirt dress and then they had these sweaters so i got this in a large i don't know how it's gonna be mm, it's probably not as long as i need it to be is it it definitely needs to be longer i think like they need to like hmm what a shame it's really cute though like a little black one they had a cream one with black stripes um but i went for the black one instead i mean i'll try it on but it's definitely too short like it needs to be like down here, but yeah, that is my H&M haul. Okay guys, I'm ready. I've actually put on some makeup. Feels like it's been a while since I put on makeup. Um, I'm about to film my H&M reel. And I'm just, I'm just trying to decide if I wanna film it on my camera or if I wanna film it on my phone. I really don't know. I'm still kind of new to this whole like reel stuff. Um, I think I'm going to do it on my phone just because it's just so much easier to just have the footage on my phone. That way I don't have to stress out about it. Hi, I'm back. I'm in a different outfit and I'm really like it and you guys can't see. I'm actually obsessed, like cannot take credit for this. Thank you to the H&M model and the girl on TikTok for ins- I swear to God, why is trip over this bed one more time? For inspiring this outfit. The black version is cute. I feel like the white version would be even cuter, but um, 
when I had somewhere to go out. And we're going out for lunch tomorrow, so maybe I could wear this tomorrow. Good morning, oh, we're Valeri. Good morning, guys. It is now Thursday, and I kind of went a little bit MIA yesterday, didn't I? I, I'm, I do apologise. I just feel like in a weekly vlog, until I've edited this video and seen, like, how long it is, I don't know how much of my days I should be filming. And to be honest, yesterday... It was boring. I literally did nothing. We got a Nando's takeaway for dinner. Also, I'm at home. I'm not sure if I mentioned, but we were meant to go to Aiden's last night and then we ended up just staying here, but we're now gonna stay at his tonight and tomorrow night because tomorrow is Aiden's birthday. I'm currently packing. I finished my morning shift at work and I've got some, what have I got here? I've got some balloons I need to pack. This is a still, bought this from Tesco. It's a balloon, what's it called? A balloon pump. Um, I have Aiden a birthday badge and I also have some little like buntings that I'm going to decorate his room with. I'm also going to go pick up my laptop today, which I'm so excited about to have my normal laptop back. I do have my old Mac here, but it's just, I have a lot of issues with it, which is why I got a new one. But it has served me well for the past over a month that it's taken to get my laptop fixed. I'm very happy to finally get my old laptop back, but I'm gonna pack now. Oh my gosh, you guys, I know I said I, oh I, know I, said I wasn't gonna um, do any iPhone footage, but my battery is about to be eaten by a spider. Oh my God, it's, oh my God, okay, he's angry. He's lifting up his legs. I'm not even showing you. He's mad. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to call my mum to come help. Cause I don't, wanna, I don't wanna go downstairs and get a glass and him disappear. I'm standing very far away right now. He looks scary. He looks large. <laughs> I'm literally ready to go. Like everything is packed and I need to go. So I'm gonna be late. But um, okay, let me call up my mum. Okay guys, the spider has been caught, but mum's just left it here with me. She said I need to put it out the window. I don't want to do it. I don't know why I'm so scared of them, but I am. Oh. But I just, I would drop the glass. I know I would drop, this is my OTD, this is what I was coming on for. I just feel like I'm gonna drop it, because I get scared. God, I don't know what I'm gonna do when I move out. Because Aiden might be at home during the day. If he was small, I'd be okay, but he's rather large. I'm gonna drop the glass, I know I will. My mum's coming down. Mother? No. You're going down? She's not even coming. He's quite, I can't do it. I'm sorry, I actually can't. Hello everyone. <laughs> I, I do apologize for the poor excuse of a vlogger I'm trying to be today. Um, I basically went out for lunch with Elle and I haven't picked up the camera since and it's now 20 past eight. But to be fair, to go like th three, four, four, what do you say, Wednesday, th three days without forgetting to vlog, for me, is pretty good. Um, so yeah, we're out for lunch. I'm now at Aiden's, as you guys can probably tell. There's not really great lighting in here, so I don't really know where to put you guys. Aiden is currently at football, so I'm here on my own. Um, but yeah, had a lovely lunch with Elle. We had some sushi and then got our nails done. My nails look literally the same. I just went for a pale pink gel colour and then we went to Primark. because so I'm going to give you guys a mini Primark haul of what I bought. There were some really cute bits in there. So the first thing I bought was a bit of homeware. I'm going to put these in my bathroom. Just two little like wooden baskets. I think they were like £10. They were £12 for two. So I thought that was pretty cute good and then the main reason i went in is because i absolutely love just sleeping in like oversized t-shirts so we went upstairs to the men's section which to be fair i actually prefer over the women's section um but these ones were two pound fifty honestly not that exciting i'm literally gonna sleep in them actually this one's gonna be a really good fake tan one seeing as it's like a tan color got like a little sage green one it's for soccer aid um so yeah, pick that one up. That one was six pounds instead. And then my mum asked me to pick up some oils. So she, sorry, I've just gone really red because the heat lamp in Aiden's um, leopard geckos cage thing has just gone really hot. So sorry about that. But my mum asked me to pick up some essential oils. However, as I said, it is now like eight o'clock, and 
I was going to decorate Aiden's bedroom tomorrow whilst he was at work for him. But I'm kind of sat here now. And all I need to do is have a shower and then fake tan. So I think I may just decorate his room now. So that at least he can come home and it will be done. And then he can get all excited for tomorrow. But oh, here's Aiden's lizard. Warning if you don't like reptiles to look away. Oh no, she's just gone. You're joking me. I did just have her out to give her a little run around, but she's now hiding. Sorry if you wanted to see the leopard gecko. She's gone, but she called sushi, just in case anyone was wondering. But, right, let's do like a time-lapse thing. Kind of made Aiden's room a bit of a mess. Well, to be fair, it actually looks a lot better than what it did. Before, it was like, you couldn't even walk on my side. But, also, I've got my laptop, and it works perfectly. Um... But anyway, enjoy my time lapse of me trying to blow up some balloons. Here's all the balloons. I've put this up. I need to just trim that end of the banner and then I just put the other half up here. So I think I'm going to put all of Aiden's presents. There's one there and obviously the other ones are over there onto his bed and then make it look pretty with all the balloons. Okay, guys, so this is what it's looking like. I'm probably going to put some of the balloons like more spread out, but obviously I'm currently, you know trying to live in this room so having balloons everywhere will not help however here are all of Aiden's presents card from me all of my presents that I've got for him and then that's from my mum and uh yeah I'm just gonna make this look a little bit more prettier and oh we're missing a balloon so yeah the next time you see me I'll probably be a little more awake and with the birthday boy potentially actually probably won't because he has to go to work tomorrow so i'll see you tomorrow on my own good morning everybody happy friday it is aiden's birthday today um so obviously not with aiden not um, not with anyone right now i'm on my own as you guys can probably tell it's currently 11.35 a.m. I've finished work for the day. There's a van driving past. Um, and I'm on my way out. So normally when I'm at Aiden's, I normally go out to my dad's because my dad literally lives like 10 minutes away. So I normally go over there and chill. Well, I say chill there. Work there for the day. Just to get me out and about. Um, but today I want to go shopping. So I just worked from Aiden's this morning. And I'm now going to go to like a retail park in Greenwich, which I'm really excited about. I've been there once. I don't know why, but I just love going to retail parks. Also, why don't I like a floating head right now? Like, <laughs> poor outfit choice today. I basically just really enjoy going. There's a massive Primark there. I want to go to Hobbycraft. I want to do something else for Aiden's birthday. And I have a little idea, but I don't know if I want to share it. Because like, if anyone knows me, I'm like the least cringiest person ever. Like I will cringe at anything and everything. Um, like I'm really not affectionate, but since meeting Aiden, he's somehow got around that side of me. So I feel like I could potentially be a little bit cringy and I don't want to share that. It makes me feel really uncomfortable. So look at my fake tan on my hand. Looks like I've literally like pooped on my hand. It's disgusting. I don't know how I managed that. Aiden's mum came into the bedroom this morning with like a, um, like a, a confetti cannon literally went everywhere it was really good like 10 out of 10 for confetti cannons but i was cleaning that up this morning and yeah now we're here and i'm going to go shopping and spend some money because that's what i do best and it was recently payday i'm talking way too much yes i'm wearing the same clothes as yesterday different pair of jeans though and i've got no makeup on i can't be bothered to put any on because we're going out later but we're not going out until like nine um so, yep. I'm also gonna go to m and and get some lunch, you know, treat yourself on a Friday to some fancy lunch. Maybe get some sushi, even though I had sushi yesterday with Elle, but we move. Hello, everybody. We are now home. I feel like, like, literally this whole vlog has just been like me. Hi, guys, I'm going out. Hi, guys, I'm now home. Do apologize. Um, I was gonna vlog when I was out. I think this might be a good place to put you guys. Um. 
it was horrendous <laughs> like I went in like okay basically I had plans to like where did I go I had plans to go to like Primark and just buy Aiden like loads of clothes because I went to Primark yesterday obviously and then loads of nice stuff but I was like oh I'll go to a different one tomorrow nothing nothing in the women's nothing in the men's I was like this is great then went to next next home had nothing next men's had nothing went to M&S nothing i did get myself some food though um should I give you guys a little haul went to tk maxx and home sense nothing <sighs> honestly i was a bit like this is why i prefer online shopping so from m &S, just got some food really this is my water bottle um so i got myself some lunch i got the plant kitchen indian no chicken wrap not my favorite i really love the mexican bean wrap from m s but we didn't have it. Got this sour cream and jalapeno combo mix. Those are great. Also picked up the chicken chorizo empanadas. Finally, I picked up Aiden a what is it? A chocolate bomble yum nut. Smells lovely. I have no idea. Saw it in the MS bakery and thought I'd give that to him for his birthday. And this is really random, really stupid, but I picked him up. I don't know why I didn't pick myself up one. Why did I not pick myself up one? I used to love these, like the chocolate lollies. I used to always get them in m &S when I used to go with my mum. But it's got a little line on it. And then I went to TK Maxx and HomeSense. Picked up a friendship bracelet kit for me and Aiden to make little bracelets together. Completely random, I know. And then the last thing I picked up, I went to Hobbycraft. And basically Aiden used to have a cork board that we kept all of our... Also, this balloon's really deflated. Um, that we used to keep all our Polaroids on, but then we decided to get rid of it. So, I went to Hobbycraft to get like a new and updated cork board, but they didn't have any big ones. The biggest ones they had was like this big. Um, and then I was in the wedding section. I started to lose hope a little bit, I'm not going to lie. I just happened to come across this. So, I know it's for weddings. It's the old, it says alternative guest book, peg and string frame guest book. And it comes with like string and tags and pegs and stuff and i guess at weddings people write a little tag and put it on but i thought this was going to be perfect for a um a what's it called for our polaroids oh it's chipped fuming i think i could just paint that obviously not right now but i'm sure we can just paint that is that everything luckily oh no it did come with string perfect right so i don't even know how much this was it doesn't actually say on there and i did definitely leave the receipt in the um in the car so not too sure how much this was but i mean obviously i don't actually need all the little brown tags i actually need to try and find all the polaroids i'm pretty sure they're going to come straw but we've got loads of little pegs we've got a string i did buy a string just in case it didn't come with any but we've got some anyway um and yeah then that is my task now i'm really bummed i don't know if you guys can see here it's got a little scratch on it but i'm honestly actually not fussed there was only this one left so that's why i got it i think my task for now is to quickly actually do this because oh, aiden's called me he's definitely on his way home isn't he god i'm gonna have to be quick well um who's the one in the middle so what are you doing I obviously can't tell you the details, uh, can I? Just mute myself so I can vlog quick. Uh, BRB, bye. bye. Okay, guys, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> I'm on the phone to Aiden. I said, I'm mute muting you so I can vlog. <laughs> I said, I'm muting myself so I can vlog. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, bye. Alright, see you in a second. Right, so I've done it. Obviously, there's not a lot of Polaroids. We always forget to take them, but. That is what it looks like. I feel like mm, I might move this one. Cute, 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 cute. Right, let's let's sort everything out. Aiden. Yeah. We're in a rush. Aiden's here. Didn't vlog yesterday. Sorry, but everybody's now here. Oh, everybody's now here. Ah! 
we've uh, got Aiden's game today. Important game, and we're in a rush. So basically, can't vlog much. Poor timing, actually. Um, can you do it maps on my phone? Yeah. Right, bye everyone, we need to- Bye everyone. Oh, I'm not even driving in neutral, oh my god, bye. <laughs> Hello everyone. Bad vlogger today. I don't know, actually. I was thinking, shall I- <laughs> Get some chocolate fingers in the car whilst I'm waiting for Aiden. Um, I don't know if I should do like a seven day vlog or like a five day weekly vlog. I don't know. Let me know what you guys want to see. However, it is now after Aiden's game, and I was gonna vlog with Aiden how they lost. So, I mean, I actually only lost 3 2, which I think is pretty decent. Um, I'm not sure if he'll, you know, appreciate me shoving a camera in his face as soon as he gets in the car. Um, but yeah, I've been at Aiden's game and now I'm waiting in the car. I do a lot of waiting in the cars on Saturdays because nine times out of ten I bring Aiden to football and he has to come in at 1.30, kick off isn't till three. And then obviously I take Aiden back to mine and the game finishes up like quarter to five, five. And he doesn't get out until like 5.30, 5.45. That's why I bring myself snacks. Because I'm, I don't know about anyone else, let me know if you're the same, but I always like, if I'm bored, I'm eating. Which is why I don't understand people. Like Aiden, for example, when he doesn't do anything all day, he doesn't eat because he's like, I'm not doing anything to make me hungry. But why is it with me, when I'm bored, I eat. And when I'm busy, I never eat. Like, make it make sense. But anyway, I'm gonna go play my game. My chocolate fingers are a little bit melted, but we move, um, and yeah. See you guys when we're home. I think my mum's making, like, chicken burgers. Oh my god, I haven't even told you guys about last night, like, what we did. But basically, it was so funny, because before we went, me and Aiden looked at reviews, and they were horrendous, like, so bad. Um... I was like to Aiden, I was like, look, I can get us a table at TGI Fridays tonight for 8.30. And our table at Rainforest Cafe wasn't until 9.30. So yeah, we were like, we were prepared for the worst. And running up to yesterday, I kept on saying to Aiden, like, you do realise at Rainforest Cafe, like, yes, adults can go. However, it's defo for the kids. And by the end of the day, Aiden wanted to go, so we went. It was interesting. Food was like mediocre at best. And then everyone sang happy birthday to him, so that was that, and then we got home and fell asleep. Okay guys, just got home. Firstly, totally forgot I had a new bed when I walked in. Also, our pet spider is still here. I thought, I told my mum he was still here. I'm sure he's still alive. I do feel a bit bad, actually. He's stuck. I think he's actually built a web. You're joking. What are we going to do? Yes, he's, he's made a web. He's gone. He's gone. Check. Is he in the glass? He's not in the glass. Quick. You got Aiden now. He's a bit Sad. more cheery, so. No. I was gonna vlog when you got out of your game, but um. Not the right time. I thought it'd be a bad time. But I've just realised I emailed Time for Sleep. I'm gonna DM them on um, Instagram actually, because they repost. I don't know if I mentioned, but I put up a story of the bed, um, and I put on the like on the actual story like. Oh, it took us like three hours to put up and it came with a broken piece, but at least it's cute. And they reposted it on their story, which I don't think is a very good advertisement on their behalf, but we moved. But anyway, I emailed them on Wednesday and I still got a reply and they said like 24 to 48 hours. So I need to follow that up, but got Aiden back. Oh, I should have vlogged us singing happy birthday. <laughs> Bought Aiden a birthday cake because he didn't actually have a birthday cake, so... I sang him happy birthday, just me, myself and I. How yeah, was it? I, I helped actually. Aiden did help because I got a little bit shy. Yeah. Now he well, just we, ignores we me had, um, We had, um, what did we have? We had, um, playing on the phone. Yeah, but it was bad from the minions. But anyway, we're gonna chillax. Got our jabs tomorrow. How are you feeling? Excited. We're gonna get jabbed in We're gonna be double jabbed. Bye. Good morning everyone. Back on our normal vlogging face. It is Sunday, last day of the week. Aiden is currently brushing his teeth, so please excuse that. Um, shock horror, we're in a rush. 
yet again. We're running a little bit late. We've got our vaccines. Well, no, we're not actually running late. We're running like just on time, but I'd like to be ready early. We got our vaccine cards that we need. You can take my makeup bag, which is over there. Vaccine cards. My mum bought some sushi because we went over to Aiden straight after. You may pop to blue water, depending on how we feel. And uh, yeah. Catch you guys after we double that, which is exciting. Guys, nice. we're double jabbed. Aiden is being so antisocial today. That's not a red card either. Is this a red card too? Aiden. I don't think that's... He's not even hurt. That wasn't dangerous. He's literally He just not even tripped hurt. up. That's not... Yeah, I don't think that's a red. Disgraceful. Red's for like dangerous play, isn't it? Yeah. I don't think that was dangerous. Or a second yellow card. But you didn't have a first. I don't know. But anyway, we're now double jabbed. We're double jabbed! I don't want to hear anyone's negative opinions about you, if I'm being completely honest. Do you want to go to Blue Water? Up to you, Queen. It's up to you. I don't mind. I'm just trying to think, it's like 12. What time's a race start? Listen, I'm not planning my day around a Formula One race. I'm having some sushi though. You want some sushi? We plan the day over... We don't, Aiden. We do, and it looks like such a sick circuit as well. Mmm. Sushi? Yeah. Mm. Hi everyone. Hi. We got Aiden's, and we're currently trying to find some food to order because I'm so hungry today. Like, actually, know what's wrong with me. I'll update you guys when we have food, maybe. Good morning, guys. Currently Monday, 11.11, make a wish. It's now Monday, obviously gonna be ending the vlog now. Wanted to update you on how I'm feeling after our vaccine. Obviously did not vlog a lot yesterday, do apologize. Obviously was at Aiden's family, so, you know, was not gonna be whipping out a vlogging camera. Um, my arm is absolutely killing, <laughs> but, Apart from that, I feel fine. I am ill. However, I started to feel ill earlier on in the week. Like, I don't think it's from the vaccine or whatsoever. Because um, I started to have a blocked nose at the, the front end of the week and my mum's ill. Apart from having a cold, which, you know, is quite frustrating. And my head hurts. I feel fine. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this weekly vlog. I really don't know how it's turned out. I'm going to edit it now. So hopefully it's okay. If it's not, I do apologise. But yeah. I'll be back with another weekly vlog. I'm going up to London at the weekend. Hopefully I'll start to feel better. Um, so yeah, that will be a lot more interesting, I think. But yeah. I shall see you all soon with another video. Like, comment, subscribe. Love you all. Goodbye. <laughs>